So now let's see how to split an image in uh, many pieces. Uh, let's take this picture here and you just have some limitation in this program because you gotta have a square image with uh, the same number of columns and, and rows like this for example. It won't be a perfect, um, a perfect work but it will be quite easy to do it so I'm gonna show you what is a program the program is this one and it's called and it's called image slicer and so you gotta import Im image slicer uh, you have to install it before and you go in the command line and uh, do pip install image slicer and I already have it and then you you go into the directory you want to go um, let's see in this directory here I got my program here and I got two uh, sub directory because I put my image to be splitted uh, in in here because so there is no much confusion when the all the image images are created so let's go and uh, you just import uh, image slicer and then you you use this function slice you put the where the image is that in this case is in a subfolder and let's go with the first one here image one uh, that is in the folder image one and as you can see you you have to know um, in this in this image here you have five five four five uh, columns and rows so we gotta change the number here in 25 and then run the prog run the program and for some reason and this is a JPEG so gotta change the extension and now you see that you will see that the images just are created here they are at 25 images because it's 545 and after this you let's make another another example with image 2 in the directory image 2 so let's let's change the folder the name of the image and as there are just 444 images you have to change it in the number in 16 and then let's run it and this is a PNG it's a different type of image and so let's see inside here all our images as you can see it's not perfect they are not not every image is perfectly uh, centered because I made this this is not perfectly squared you know and you see here this little heart here is also in this other image so the program is very simple just one line of code and the work will be done but there is this limitation and maybe there is some other way to, to do it uh, with this module but uh, that's all I know for now about it thank you